five Windows 11 tips and tricks which everyone should know. And if you already know that, that's really great. So I have decided I have chosen five tips and tricks which will be most handy and very useful for you. So the very first is the snipping tool. So you can look at your keyboard if you're using a laptop. They can, there will be a print screen on F11. The moment you press that, snipping tool option will come. So let's say if you want to take a screenshot, you just have to press the print screen and then you can select the uh, rectangular mode or the freeform mode or like windows mode or the full screen. You can also press windows key, shift key and S. Windows key, shift key and S together. The moment you do that, you will get the screen again. All right. So this is the first tip. And the second is the enable dark mode on Windows 11. This is also a great Windows 11 feature. You just need to do a right click in your start icon, go to settings. And at the left hand side, we have this personalization. Click on that and then go to colors. And here you can select choose your mode. So you can select the dark mode like this. You can use the light mode where everything will be light. So I have selected the custom where I want my windows in black like the task manager and apps light. So you can also try that. Dark mode is very, I mean, it's very good for eyes, especially in the night. You can try that and you can use it i use custom custom then dark and then light this works for me very great and the third is file explorer tab so you can search file explorer and here let's say if i have opened music i also want picture i can simply click on that it just works like the browser so you can switch to the tabs of Windows Explorer or I would say File Explorer this really a very great handy feature through which we can switch to tabs without opening a individual tab so that is also a good feature the fourth is the emoji I personally don't like much but there are many uh, who use emojis especially when they are using social media so you can press the Windows key on a keyboard and then full stop the period the moment you do that you will find the emojis like this so you need to look at a keyboard press windows key and full stop i mean the period key and the moment you press windows and period key together you will find the emojis like this so you can type it anywhere wherever you want to use the emojis so that's the fourth, for fourth uh, tip. And the final tip, the fifth is disable or enable notifications. This is also a very important feature uh, introduced in, in Windows 11. You just need to do a right click in the start icon and then go to settings. And at the left hand side, you will find system. I'll click on that. And here you will find notifications. So you can disable all notifications, which I would not recommend it. I would recommend to go bottom notification from apps and do it custom. So there are some apps through um, those notifications are important for you. So you can manually and do the custom disable notifications. So you can try which all notifications you want and which don't. So let's say if I want the camera notification or Microsoft Store, I can turn it on and I can turn it off, which I do not need. All right. So these are the five tips, which is very handy. I'm sure you also like it. And do let me know in the comment section. If you have find this tutorial helpful, please hit the like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.